Hi, today I'm going to be reading I Need a Hug. I love hugs. Do you love hugs? As the early morning sun rose over the zoo, the animals were waking up, all except for Boo, the bush baby. Like all bush babies, Boo slept in the daytime, so he was ready for bed. But where was Mummy? Boo couldn't sleep without his mummy, special, mummy's special bedtime hug. Boo looked everywhere, but mummy was nowhere to be seen. So Boo went to see Lion. I need a hug, Boo said to Lion. Very gently, Lion lifted Boo in one big paw and hugged him close. Thank you, Lion. Spluttered Boo, but with a mouthful of lion's mane. But your hug is too hairy. So Boo went to see Giraffe. I need a hug. Boo called up to Giraffe. Giraffe stopped what she was doing, wrapped her long neck around Boo and hugged and lift him all at once. Thank you, Giraffe, gulped Boo looking down at the ground below, but your hug is too high. So Boo went to see Penguin. I need a hug, Boo called to Penguin. Penguin looked up from his breakfast, stretched out his flippers and pulled, to Boo's, uh, pulled Boo towards him. Thank you, Penguin, choked Boo, holding his nose, but your hug is too fishy. Ew. So Boo went to see Kangaroo. I need a hug. Boo shouted to Kangaroo. Oh, wait. I need a hug, Boo shouted to Kangaroo as she pounded past. Without stopping, Kangaroo swept Boo off his feet and hugged him as she hopped on her way. Thank you, Kangaroo, Boo managed to say. In between each jump, but your hug is too bouncy. Boing. Boo was tired and he needed a bedtime hug more than ever. Perhaps Parrot could help. I need a hug, yelled Boo above Parrot's loud squawks. Squawk! Parrot, Parrot carried on squawking, spreading his wings and hugged Boo into his feathery, feathery chest. Thank you, Parrot, yelled Boo. But your hug is just too noisy. Squawk! What about Polar Bear, wondered Boo. I need a hug, said Boo, looking up into Polar Bear's face. Friendly, uh, Polar Bear's friendly face. Very carefully, Polar Bear opened her arms and gathered Boo up into her soft white fur. Thank you, Polar Bear, yawned Boo, squinting. But your hug is too bright. What was, what was Boo to do. It was time for bed and th and still was no mummy and still no just right bedtime hug. Too wrinkly, too bumpy, too tight, too tickly, too big, too wet. I don't need a hug that is too hairy, too high, too fishy, too noisy, too bouncy, too bright. Too wrinkly, too bumpy, too tight, too tickly, too big, or too wet, whispered Boo to himself. I need a hug. That's, that's. Just then, Boo felt warm, safe, comfy arms around him. That's just right, he shouted happily. Sleep tight, Boo, said Mummy, as she gave him the cuddliest, snuggliest, just right bedtime hug in the whole world. The end.